All right, man, check this out, man. We out here on Napa TV. I'm over here with my man, Bruce Feast is in the house. What's up, man? What's up, brother? I'm here hey, man, man, why, 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 why are you out here, man? I'm out here just, I guess like everybody else, like watching a car crash. Yeah, watching watch a crash. Why, why, why are you out here, People man? People out here, want, they want to see Don Trump, the man that wants to send you back to Africa, the man trickle down Trump with trickle down economics. The man has ignored blacks the whole campaign. He's coming to the blackest city in America and going to tell us, what do we got to lose? Well, you got to lose everything. If, if, if yeah, man, but hold on, hold on, hold on, man. For real, man. Uh, you and I uh, know uh, each other, man. Long time. We out here protesting. We, are, protest, we always protesting, and, uh, protesting against a white man. Right. Who talk crazy. Uh, Y'all right, ain't protesting Clinton. She ain't right, talking shit. Right, right, right. Clinton called you a super predator. Clinton gave you three strikes crime really out. Clinton gave I mean, you let's Atlanta. keep it real. I mean, we, just, we don't protest. We sitting out here protesting Trump. We don't protest well, Clinton. The funny thing is, you're right. Uh, Sam Riddle said that we're fighting over which plantation we're going to be on. The Clinton plantation <laughs> or the Trump plantation. That's well, a Sam my Riddle thing quote. Is, see, my thing, see, my thing is, That's my the, thing is, the my lesser thing, of two evils. It, it is the lesser of two, it's two evils. <laughs> we keep it real with you, man. We sit up here and protest and all right. these things. But we don't go out here in mass and protest for, to, to improve our schools. That's true. To have That's people true. stop raping our women That's true. and stop uh, right. cutting, oh, stop right, cutting, the, cutting the balls That's off our black men. Right. We gotta stop. We gotta start really taking some serious consideration, no, you're right. man. You're right. Don't it's, you agree with that? That's right. Like people say, black lives matter, but they also matter when black skill blacks. We have black lives matter when black skill blacks. It's like Absolutely. I'm just trying to figure out why this gentleman. Oh, man, you're, you're a Tiger fan. You're a Tiger oh, fan. Oh, you're a Tiger fan. I'm just trying to figure. I'm just trying to figure out why this cat taking a. You a fan? Are you a fan? A fan of what? Are you a fan? Are you a fan? Of Tiger? Of course I'm I a thought you was a fan. fan. I, thought I thought he was a federal agent taking a picture of me. No, no I'm, I'm just talking mess. <laughs> are they telling them? Now they telling them to go home. No, they telling them to go home and come here. <laughs> but what do we do? What do we do when our schools are failing? No, 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 all right, here we go. Yes, sir. Yes, I do. I want this beautiful black woman right here. What's why are you out here? She's not gonna say anything to me. I love you though. I've been talking. Can, can you give me ten seconds? What are you doing, Danny? Posting. Facebook. Yeah. So anyway, so anyway, we people are out here. I couldn't get inside. I couldn't get inside Great Faith Ministries this morning. Had a mix up, but it's all good. So I'm out here with these uh, people protesting. They protest. Black folks love to protest, but damn it, when it comes to these schools, and get the hell out of Detroit. She's saying she's telling Trump to get the hell out of Detroit, but what good would that do? In the, in the end. Now, I ain't no Trump supporter by no means. I ain't no damn Trump supporter. You telling a ten billion dollar man to get the hell out of Detroit, and Detroit got a mean income of twenty four thousand dollars. What the hell's wrong with this picture, y'all? Look at this. Now keep in mind, we standing on the corner of Grand River and Oakland in the city of Detroit. Grand River Open Boulevard. This the hood. It ain't it ain't jungle. It ain't jungle enough. See if it was me getting Donald Trump, I'd have took his ass to French and Grashit, Houston Whittier and Grashit, took him down to the Osborne district on the side streets and let the hood talk to him. You know what I'm saying? I guess he's getting on the. I guess he's getting on the the bus now, and getting ready to go to his next destination. All this protesting and stuff, man. We love to talk. We love to protest. But who has the better master plan to build our community up economically? We need economics to build our community, not social justice. There you go, the kid, the kid delay. There you go, trickster, racist, unscrupulous, megalomaniac, and phony. There was a lady. Y'all see that, America? Let, let's get that. Do y'all believe? Do y'all agree with that? 
it doesn't make any difference with me. People got the right to people got the right to speak their minds as far as I'm concerned. People got the right to speak their minds, but I'm but I'ma keep it 100 with y'all. If y'all not talking about economics, if you're not talking about building black businesses, putting money in black investment inside the hood, it doesn't make any damn difference. So it is what it is. This damn, this man Trump so damn, this guy Trump and shut down Grand River. I ain't never seen no mess like that in my life. I don't, I don't think I've seen nobody shut down Grand River. This man has shut down Grand River. Damn. Damn. It's okay for us to protest, but at the end of the day, where's your money going? Are you still going out to Fairlane, Southland, all them other places? We got to invest. Economics is the key, not this social justice bullshit. We got to start really paying attention and building our communities economically first, and we can only do that with financial empowerment, financial education, and really, really move to the next step, y'all. You protesting a $10 billion man which is okay. I'm not supporting him. But are you out there protesting Hillary as well? Oh, I forgot. You can't protest Hillary because her dinners are $4,000 or $2,000, whatever the case may be. You protest Hillary too, huh? Sir, I protest Hillary, Trump, hell. I'll protest some of these folks here. Yep. They have some of these folks here, charlatans too, in check the name it. of social justice. Yes, yeah, but check this out, bro. Check this out. Yes, sir. We've been dealing with man for president of the United States since George Washington days. Yes, sir. To the present, today. Yes, sir. Been man's in the White House forever. Yes, sir. And look at it. Look how the economy is. Let's give her an opportunity. Maybe she'll do the things that she said. We knocking the lady before we even give her a chance. Maybe she's gonna do them things she says she's gonna here, do. Here, here. She's gonna fight for you. Nah. The men's is not gonna fight for you. If, if, if it doesn't fatten their damn pockets, they're not gonna fight for you. I, man. I, let me say, let me say this. And I and I, I and listen. I'm, I'm, I want to. Everybody know me out there in Nabaland that I'm about women empowerment. I really am. Yeah. But, but 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 okay. but this woman has been around for a long time. She's yes. part of the Clinton machine. With her, with her husband. Yeah. I don't mind a woman being president. I just want somebody in the 21st century woman to be president with 21st century ideas that are connect us to the global market. Black folks got to understand, my brother, that it's not just African Americans. Africans are suffering over in Sub-Saharan Africa. It's time to unite our economies right. to build our communities up. Okay. And I want a visionary like that. Clinton, okay. the, Clinton doesn't represent that, nor does Trump. Okay. Now... When, that, when Clinton was in the White House, the economy was doing real good, man. Everybody was working. Black folks were doing well. They could pay their bills. They had jobs. The, the, the deficit was down to zero. Mm -hmm. it's when Bush is in them, the Republicans start getting in and they start messing up things. The Republican Party is a real, very racist party, man. They've been racist for... This is nothing new about the Republicans. The They've Republican been Party, the Republican Party, sir, is what? Historically, the Republican Party, historically, we all know this. They're the ones that help with the with help with the whole civil, uh, not civil rights, but they did help a little bit about that. But understanding the Emancipation Proclamation, we just can't. It's not just a party; it's a mentality. You understand? Because I can say white Democrats, white Democrats can be just as racist as, as a white Republican. Mm -hmm. Hell, hell! In fact, a white Democrat, if you go and roll out, they're not out here protesting. They solve their problems by economics. Okay. A black Democrat solved their problems with social justice. That's why the shit looked like Grand River and Oakman. And so, and so, it's, so it's not just a party per se. We got to get away from that. A 21st century 